I'm Archbishop Mark Coleridge and you are watching Q&A, question and answer for the Catholic leader. Many of us were deeply moved by the recent death of Bishop Michael Putney, Bishop of Townsville here in Queensland. I certainly was. He was a great old friend of mine, in fact one of my closest personal friends from years and years ago. Michael had been dying of cancer for about 15 months and it had been a long slow journey but it had been a very powerful journey because the way in which Michael stood before the mystery of death as a man of faith was uh, something that deeply impressed everybody including me. Uh, the serenity and even the joy with which he faced death was nothing short of remarkable and it's something which only Easter and Easter faith can produce. I have so many memories of Michael Putney. Uh, back to our student days in Rome back in the early 1980s when we really uh, got to know each other, sitting around meal tables in Rome, uh, conversation that was intelligent, amusing, insightful, encouraging, all of that stuff uh, with lashings of uh, Italian pasta and, and wine, they were unforgettable moments that were a crucial part of the Roman experience, my education in the Eternal City. More recently, we, uh, the Queensland bishops visited Townsville with the Apostolic Nuncio, Archbishop Paul Gallagher. Because Michael couldn't travel, we decided to take the mountain to Mahomet, so we went, all of us, up to Townsville and we were there for a couple of days and it was an unforgettable couple of days in part because it was such a buzz and a lift for Michael himself. But for all of us, it was deeply moving to see the ways in which he was so loved by a people he had so loved. Michael became part of Townsville and Townsville became part of him. He loved the diocese and to see that as it were in the flesh when we visited Townsville was uh, a, a marvellous thing and one of those memories of him that I will take to the grave. My final memory of him was a text that he sent me when I was in Jerusalem. He actually died while I was on pilgrimage in Jerusalem but he sent me a final text and he said, the cancer is progressing and so am I. And then he finished with his last words to me in a text, but his last words were simply, God is good. Those simple words take you to the heart of the mystery of the man Michael Putney, who was also very good. May he rest in peace.